Hello everyone, <coughs> this is Keegan. Uh, I just wanted to show off my Twiddler now that I've finished it. Um, I decided to make like a retro looking thing. Um, and so it's got some little uh, effects on there that are a little silly, but I like them. Um, I also like the idea of making it so that it was a keyboard based interface so that you don't have to click things. Um, so let me show that off a little bit. I'll just refresh it so that it goes back to how it starts. Um, so you see that little, there's a box that highlights the first um, tweet up at the top. And you can scroll up and down with the J and K keys. Um, that's to imitate the, the Vim keys. Um, so you can scroll all the way up and down. Um, and if you, um, if you want to see your friends, you press F, boop, and then the friends list comes up. And you use J and K also to scroll through that. Um, press Enter when you want to see. Uh, the friend, boop, and then it reloads the feed there with just that person, um, and then you can you can see the key shortcuts up at the top. So B should take me back. Uh, ooh, but it doesn't. It's broken. Uh, I guess I have to click it. Hold on, I'm gonna click it. There we go. I'll get that shortcut fixed. Um, so now we're back to the main feed, um, and I also have it so that you can press a button and start making a tweet. So I press T, and then you can see down there at the bottom. Uh, a little form pops up for entering the tweet. So you enter your handle. Um, I'm Keegan, so I'm going to write Keegan. And my tweet is, uh, hello, this is a boring tweet. Uh, press enter, and it pops up at the top there with a little picture of Emmanuel Kant. Um, so there you go, and you can keep adding tweets all day. And they keep popping up, along with the other ones that have come into the feed since we last tweeted. Um, so that's my thing. I um, uh, hope you all like it, and I'm excited to see your alls.